السلام علیکم مائی نیم از محمد عماد اختر رجسٹریشن نمبر ایس پی ٹوینٹی ٹو بی ایس سی زیرو زیرو سکس سیمسٹر از فرسٹ دا ٹاپک ٹوڈے آئی ایم گوئنگ ٹو پرزینٹ از ہسٹری آف مارشل لا ان پاکستان دا ٹیبل آف کانٹینٹ از انٹروڈکشن فرسٹ مارشل لا سیکنڈ مارشل لا تھرڈ مارشل لا اینڈ فورتھ مارشل لا انٹروڈکشن مارشل لا ریفرس ٹو دا امپوزیشن آف ملٹری رول انسٹیڈ آف ریگولر سویلین اتھارٹیز When armed forces overthrow the elected civilian governments, then martial law is imposed. The implication of martial law may either be a positive step to restore order or an active action to suppress dispute. Martial law was imposed for four times in different periods throughout the history of Pakistan. Through the life of Pakistan, half of the time has been lived under military rule and the major reason behind was political instability. After the assassination of first premier of Pakistan, Yaqat Ali Khan, country had to face tremendous obstacle in the way of smooth working government first martial law 1958 martial law was imposed on 7th october 1958 martial law was imposed by sikandar mirza chief martial administrator was general ayub khan After Governor General Muhammad Ghulam Muhammad was compelled to go on a two month leave to United Kingdom Major General Iskandar Mirza entered the office of Governor General on August 7 1955 After coming to rule as Governor General in 1955 he could not make good relations with any of the coming premiers New constitution was adopted on 23rd March 1956 and Iskandar Mirza became the president Then came the fateful day of October 7, 1958 when Iskandar Mirza proclaimed the martial law throughout the country and appointed Army Chief General Muhammad Ayub Khan and Chief Martial Law Administrator. In 1960, Ayub Khan held basic democratic units elections and elected their 80,000 members, which then by secret ballot exercise expressed their confidence in Ayub Khan. Thus, Ayub Khan became the elected president in February 17, 1960 and lifted martial law on June 8, 1962. The main reason behind this martial law was the political turmoil in the country. Second martial law 1969. Martial law was imposed on 25th March 1969. Martial law was imposed by General Yahya Khan. Chief martial law administrator was General Yahya Khan. Second martial law was imposed when President Ayub Khan stepped down. President Ayub Khan handed over powers to General Yahya Khan and abrogated the constitution of 1962. On April 8, General Yahya Khan announced that martial law administrators of East and West Pakistan will also perform the duties of governors. After Yahya Khan resigned on 20 December 1971 and Zulfikar Ali Bhutto became first civilian chief martial administrator and president of Pakistan. The main reason of second martial law was anti-Ayub agitation in the country and a need of space for political activities. Third martial law 1977. Martial law was imposed on 5th July 1977. Martial law was imposed by General Ziaul Haq, Chief Martial Law Administrator General Ziaul Haq. Third martial law was imposed when General Ziaul Haq overthrew the Bhutto government. National and provincial governments were dissolved the constitution was put into abeyance October 18 1977 was fixed for the general election under the supervision of armed forces and judiciary on October 1st the elections were postponed indefinitely on November 10th 1977 the supreme court of pakistan unanimously validated the imposition of martial law under doctrine of necessity fourth martial law 1999 Martial law was imposed on 12 October 1999. Martial law was imposed by General Pervez Musharraf. Chief Martial Law Administrator was General Pervez Musharraf. Fourth Martial Law was imposed when General Pervez Musharraf dissolved the elected government of Nawaz Sharif. On April 30, 2002, before the election, a referendum was held for him to be elected the Prime Minister for another five years. On November 3, 2007, he declared the state of emergency in the country, which is claimed to be equal to the state of martial law. On November 12, 2007, Musharraf issued some amendments to the Military Act, which gave the armed forces some additional powers. This was all. Thank you.